Happy Wednesday, friends. It's time to learn a new letter. Today, we are going to learn the letter that says the sound D. Who knows what letter says the sound D? That's right. It's the letter D, like duck or dog. Can we think of other words that start with D? These are words like we said, duck, dog, maybe doctor, don't, do. Why don't we try thinking of words that end in the letter D? Like mad or sad or rod or pod. Remember, it's important to hear the letter sound and think of words that either begin or end in the sound to help us when we begin reading. While we're reading, you can look for words that have these letters in them, like the word did. It begins and ends in the letter D. Now let's take a closer look at the letter D and the two parts that make it up. We have a big line and a big curve. So when we're skywriting, we're going to first draw a big line from the top going down. We pick up our pencil, we go back to the top and we draw a big curve, connecting the top and the bottom of that line. So we go down from the top, pick up our pencil, big curve down to the bottom. We go down from the top, pick up our pencil, big curve down to the bottom. Now let's practice tracing. As you can see on this page, we just are practicing those curves. We're gonna take those ducks around a curve spinning in the pond. So we're gonna big curve, big curve. Notice that these curves are the opposite of the letter C. So they're not going backwards around, but they're going forwards and around. And finally, let's practice drawing the two parts together. Say the letter name, the movements, and then the sound. D, big line down, pick up our pencil, big curve. D says D. As always, friends, you can go back and do this with any of the letters that we've done so far. It'll be extra practice for us, and we'll be so ready for kindergarten. I will see you next time. Have a great week.